you know, you've got to admire all the players who've really put in for the last five weeks, really. You know, you've got 45 players who've absolutely given everything and uh, to reduce it even by one player would make it difficult. But obviously, there does come a point where you need to get down closer to that um, 31 number that goes into the World Cup. You've got to make sure you've got um, versatility and flexibility within your squad to cover those 31 slots in the World Cup. So, you know, you've got five props, but you need a tight head who can play a loose head or a loose head who can play a tight head. You need a 15 who can play a 10, um, or you need a 10 who can play a 12, um, because you're, you're one injury away from having to utilise that flexibility within your squad. So um, that's sometimes an asset for a player where he's got versatility, and sometimes it, it probably counts a little bit against a player if there is a lack of versatility. And that's, that's no fault of the players, that's just the criteria that surround this particular selection going into this World Cup. As I said to them, them all, you know, they're one injury away, um, one step away from being back in the squad anyway. I mean, we've got a game obviously coming up against France uh, and, let's like say, one injury and suddenly they're, they're back in the equation. So, um, you know, they've been fantastic and they've, they've dealt with it well. Um, the great team players, all of them, and uh, I'm sure their chance will come again. There's a lot of rugby to be played this year.